it's your boy Jatwa, and I'm here today with some uh, various craft that I decided to try with in Ferrum Aerospace. For God knows what reason! I wanted to torture myself a bit. I, I kind of like the idea of Ferrum because it forces you to think a bit more than normal. Let's see if I have clearance for these. Barely! <laughs> Ooh! Inches! Don't know how much flight we're going to get out of it. Whoa! go <laughs> now Pharaoh's probably freaking out right now there we go stalling large scales stall and kill off the engines <laughs> all right so we're gonna cut it on ever so slightly and we're gonna toggle our hover and it's kind of working. It's kind of working. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> it also gives us this really flyable craft here that I cannot use with. I can't use any of my linear exhaust anythings with it. Because it's really a strange craft that ooh, or, uh, wants to fly apart. And I don't know why it's, it's wagging its tail here. But it does not like... <laughs> Ferrum does not like what I'm doing right now. <laughs> there it goes. That's a little better. Alright. I know. Large scale. F fall. Lar large scale. Large scale. I know. I know. All right. Uh, <laughs> uh, I think we got it. <laughs> it works. <laughs> oh man, that is a hard thing to fly. That is a hard thing to fly. Uh, so, it does work in Ferrum, sort of, kind of, kind of, sort of, but it does fly, let me give you a nice view of this craft, alright, so that's one, I'm going to try one more out, because I think I have time for one more, and if I can make that one fly in here, well, it'll be an accomplishment, so, I'll be right back. Alright, so now we have Ferrum back visible, we have our air intakes this time, and let's see what happens when we try to launch. <laughs> As you can see, Ferrum does not let you sneak off the ground in like two seconds. And away we go. Whoa. <laughs> And it doesn't like that at all. <laughs> That's a minor stall. All right, <laughs> revert to launch. Uh, there we go. There we go. Why does it fly better with the big head? <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I take it all back. It flies horribly with the big head. <laughs> Ferrum does not uh, appreciate the big head designs as much as I would expect. EVA, my friend. <laughs> uh, yep, that didn't work. Everybody died. Everything did. <laughs> Okay, well, I have enough time for one more with that absolute failure. Be right back. All right, so here we go. Uh, this is the the LES AES Rover. It's a version of the Fanback Rover series, except for I never really got a chance to try it in Ferrum. Uh, let's see. Does it? 
I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> All right, let me see what's going on here. Now that's over and done with. I actually like the idea of intake atmosphere a lot better than the intake air idea, simply because you're just vacuuming in whatever the atmosphere that you're within and exhausting it outwards through the ports. So it would make more sense if it was intake atmosphere versus the intake air, in my humble opinion. This time we should have a bit more control. There we go. Gear are up. That works a lot better. Okay, so we're going to actually try to shoot the tunnel. Oh, I think I got it. I think I'm low enough. I, I might not be low enough. We might not be low enough. <laughs> I don't think we're low enough. I don't think we're low enough. <laughs> we're not low enough. Ooh. That was a bad idea. <laughs> oh. That was our power that we knocked out. <laughs> <laughs> what an end to a fantastic craft. Well, well now, that is actually very hilarious. I'm going to leave it at that, mostly because one, yes, it can shoot the gap if I get low enough, but two, this is absolutely a hilarious way to end it. So if you like what you're seeing, definitely hit that like button. Ferrum is a fantastic mod. Ferrum Aerospace. If you've never used it, it will give you additional challenges uh, because it, it places more realistic flight characteristics in the game. So you have to worry about things like your lift a bit more and your aerodynamic uh, failures. Different things that normally I do not care about because I'm just like, we I'm flying around and whatever. I don't care if my craft wants to fall apart because it's not going to. But with Inferum, you have to worry about that. But eh, some people like it. Some people don't. Some people don't want their craft to do all that. Some people don't want to have to worry about things like that. Nonetheless, it is still a fun mod to try. So... If you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button, share something out to your friends, drop me in a comment, let me know what you think, hit that like button if you like what you've been seeing, and I hope to catch you guys in the next video. For now, this is your boy Jatois, and I'm out. Peace. Kerbin. Moon. Ooh. <laughs> Wait, we're still alive? We're still alive? Oh. Yes. Yes. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, <laughs>